This is an interesting one today. We're at Dugards on the south coast. This machine here is a Samsung PL60 LM. Now, if you watch a lot of our reviews, we tend generally to talk about smaller turning centers and smaller, smaller lathes. This is completely different. This is an absolute beast of a machine, this is. Uh, I'm gonna move this control. You can see to start with, actually, that the control moves on, um, on this action here. Now, you, what you will notice as well is that the Swarf conveyor and the Swarf extraction system hasn't actually been fitted to this machine yet. So when you, you see, the, um, see the base of the machine, you'll, you'll see what the reason for the gap is. But of course, when you buy a machine like this, you're gonna need Swarf extraction, so that can be fitted after. If we move into the machine here, we'll start by looking, firstly, at this, this casting, this beefy casting. You would expect a machine of this size to have a big chunky box guideway build and this is this is no different this is exactly what this machine has got but it also is the same where the turret operates now this is a straight three axis machine and we've got mill drill function on that turret and it is in fact a 12 station turret and all the stations on the turret can be driven as we work our way down the turning length we can see this this chuck here and as I look at it I'm trying to identify what the what the size is and I think it's a 21 inch chuck with a tool setting arm next to it which comes with the machine now this machine here we're actually outlining the prices here at Dugard this 3.2 meter turned length machine with a fan at control is 236,250 pounds it's got 139 mil bar capacity 12 meters a minute in the x-axis and 8 meters a minute in the z when you look at a machine like this isn't that imperative uh, but the spindle speed is and the power of the spindle 1500 rpm and 45 kilowatts of spindle power there's lots of uh, features that come with a machine like the programmable tailstock and the programmable quill you would need that on a part like on a machine like this because you need to support the component i think it's important to emphasize the structure of the machine the build of the machine and the fact that if you are looking at a machine of this size there isn't lots and lots of options available to you in the marketplace there is a few and this is one and you can see this machine here at Dugard in the UK it's the PL60 LM which means it's got driven tools it means it's got a long bed it's available from stock again you can have this machine delivered pretty quickly if you're looking at manufacturing components of a sizable nature then this is an option to you check it out on dugard.com